Big yep. deal? No big deal. It is a big deal for two reasons, right. near term and long term. One, near term, James Harden and the Rockets are coming. I mean, Chris Paul, even though, listen, should they be struggling with the Mavericks? Well, the Texas rivalry there on the road, Chris Paul saves the game with a block, right? Chris Paul is back. He's healthy. Clint Capella is back. They have the whole squad back. As Delic is the defensive coordinator again. James Harden has had an MVP caliber season. Might even get it, even though the Greek freak has been balling out all year. Stephen A., we both saw it, that James Harden was doing certain things that made you believe maybe he was overcoming the yips in the playoffs, played defense the whole time. If James Harden can hit big shots, I'm just telling you. So the Warriors have to be fully loaded. If Draymond's a problem, you say that the, that the, uh, that the uh, league gave – the, the Cavs, a stimulus package when they suspended Draymond that game, Stephen A, when the Cavs beat him. Nevertheless, he got suspended. Like, he took the bait. If there's a little fracture in the team there, there's a little fissure that can be exploited, that could be a problem for the Warriors. That's the first, that's the first issue right now, why it's a big deal. The second is this, Stephen A. We sure Kevin Durant's coming back? Because if we're not, no. we sure Clay Thompson's coming back. If they don't back up the truck and give Klay Thompson the supermax, you think he's not going to, I don't know, the Lakers, for example, right? This is huge in the near run and the short run. This could be the twilight of the great dynasty of this era, the Golden State Warriors. So when you see stuff like this, you can't just, well, yeah, it's a typical stuff. They'll be fine. Oh, I'm not so sure. I am. It's absolutely positively nothing to worry about. The only thing missing is a latte or a hot chocolate for me personally. I'm not really, because I'm not concerned, not even a little bit. Not even a little bit. You know, I was with them a couple of weeks ago, a little less than a couple of weeks ago. The Golden State Warriors have a very, very hard time maintaining interest. Oh, my God, I wonder why that is. Could it be four straight trips to the NBA Finals? Could it be three NBA championships? Could it be the fact that they know that no one cares about anything when it comes to them but April, mid-April, May, and June, meaning the postseason? It's a foregone conclusion they're going to be one of the top two seeds in the Western Conference, as has been the case all of this particular time. Their resident superstar, which is Steph Curry, uh, just signed $207 million. Uh, you know, what's he doing? Averaging what he's averaging, over 27, over 25 points a game. All right, shooting about 43% from three-point range. These brothers are lethal. Klay Thompson misses about three games. They're struggling. Doesn't seem to say what happens. He comes back and shoots 81% from three-point range. <laughs> he had nine of 11 threes Friday night. This is what they do. Hey, Kevin Durant, he was asleep. I mean, we couldn't find him. We didn't know what the hell. Did, did Kevin Durant even play? Oh, here he is. He just dropped 26. This is what they do. It's nothing Question. to concern about. So this is what it comes down to, Max. These guys have admitted to me to my face. Steve Kerr admitted it last year. Sometimes it's just hard for these guys to be interested. So much so that he actually had them coach themselves. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Game. I mean, listen, man. It's, 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 it's nothing to worry about at all. Now, if you're talking about, oh, my good, will they stay together after this season? That's a different story. I'm talking about this remember season. Remember when Mike Tyson There's lost the bus to, to Douglas about. in Tokyo? What about it? Biggest upset ever, right? Know why, know why it was in Tokyo, not in this country? Why? No one wanted to pay for another 90-second knockout. Mm -hmm. Mike Tyson, well, Mike Tyson, what, he went the distance with this guy. Well, he wasn't interested. What's your point? My point is, that. at the highest the level of sport, it's actually closer than people think. Let me cross-examine the witness here, Steve. Sure. Four years ago, mm -hmm. when the Cavs took the Warriors six games in the finals, the yep. Cavs were the second-best team, yep. who was the second-best player on that Cavs team during that during that finals. Well, it was Kevin Love. Well, actually, no. Kevin Love. Was hurt? Kevin Love was hurt. Kyrie, Kyrie Irving, Irving was went hurt? down in game one. So who Kyrie was LeBron's second? Matthew Delavadova. They went six games with those Golden sure, State Warriors. Sure, Following year, they beat them mm -hmm. in seven games on the, the road. The stimulus package. The stimulus, stimulus package. package. The stimulus package handed by Adam Silver. Yes. The Go following ahead. year, they got Kevin Durant. That's right. Obliterated and got, and everyone got obliterated. in sight. That's right. But then last year, they went seven games on the road 
with the Rockets, and the Rockets didn't have CP3. Now, you will argue that if CP3 well, was there, five games. Th but they didn't have him in Game all 7. Right, all right. And you would argue if CP3 was there, mm -hmm. the, the Warriors mm -hmm. would have elevated again. It was right. still a single-digit right. loss right. Right. like right. for the Rockets without their second-best right. player having mm -hmm. a terrible shooting night. Mm -hmm. What I'm saying is as invincible as they seem, mm -hmm. boy, they've had some close calls and have even lost yeah. a finals.